Homecoming at Beaver Stadium. On game day, starting with a tailgate, ending with a tailgate, and having a great time at Beaver Stadium in between. It's wonderful to be the part of 107,000. Greatest part is just watching the boys play and give it all they got. State College is unbelievable. The whole, the whole game weekend experience, it's just very festive. Everybody comes together for the same reasons and support the team. So to be in the stands, it's, the stands are always packed. I mean, it feels like we're all together for the same issue. So it's, uh, it's, it's beautiful. I mean, there's no feeling like it. up at the five and he's hit right away it'll be dropped tyler yazzy and the long snapper led the charge that time for the Nittany lions diamant rolls near side he'll keep it and go and is hit and austin johnson will rip him down for a loss far hash going left to right with 740 to go in the quarter hackenberg play action fake steps away from pressure throws it down wheel route for polk got him at the 15 10 5 touchdown a 39-yard strike from Christian Hackenberg to Brandon Polk, and the Nittany Lions get on the board first. This is what you want from Hackenberg. Lay the ball out there and let your wide receiver make the play. Takes the snap, throws, and it is knocked down and incomplete. Penn State's front-line defense did the job here. Ackerberg takes it, wants to throw again. Throws their side. Lewis makes the catch. 24 breaks the tackle. 25 near side. 30. 35 spins to the 39 near the 40-yard line. And a first down for Penn State. And it's about making moves after you catch the football. Getting that yak. That's how you change field position. Demont plenty of time. And he finally runs out of it. Garrett Sickles, the sophomore out of Red Bank, New Jersey, with the big hit. The deep back behind Xander Diamant. And getting into the backfield to bust it up is Troy Reader. Troy Reader did a good job of timing this up. Motion away from us. Play action fake. Hackenberg waits long and deep for Hamilton at the five. Got it. Touchdown. Penn State perfectly thrown by Christian Hackenberg. And the Nittany Lions take the lead. Hackenberg does a great job of laying the ball out there in man to man coverage. Hamilton makes the catch right in stride for the touchdown. That's problematic for the Hoosiers with Austin Johnson unabated to the quarterback. Got him for a loss back in the 15-yard line. Austin Johnson burst through for a 10-yard sack. Team to five and one. He's going to run with it again inside the 10, and it will be first and goal. Penn State. Christian Hackemer using his legs to get the job done. Penn State trying to punch it in here with under a minute to go in the half. Hackenberg turns, play action, rolls right. He's got the far corner. Christian Hackenberg's got a touchdown. Penn State, the Nittany Lions put together a brilliant drive. Hey, zero, zero. Yes, zero, zero. Win the second half. Yes, play fast, play violent, play confident Penn State football together. You guys understand me? Yes, sir. Zero, zero. Let's go win the second half. Let's go. 
They're on the far ash from the 25-yard line to start. Throws, Page makes the catch, and oh, in traffic, okay. what a play by Penn State to Bell. take a down. Brandon Bell with an outstanding play in space. Chased, rolls far side. Zettel chases him, now Sickles chases, throws across his body, almost intercepted by Lucas at the 40. Takes the snap, he'll throw, knocked down by Evan Schwan and incomplete. Cameron takes it, Cameron will give the ball to Redding and take it down by Nassib and Sickles. The two ends converge for no gain. That's what you end up teaching these defensive linemen. That's what Zettel's able to do on the play and ends up deflecting the fourth down pass. Back goes Cameron, delivers downfield and intercepted by John Reed of Penn State off the deflection. At the 48 yard line, John Reed with his second pick of the year. Hackerberg play action fake. Sets up, waits, throws. Carter's got a 50 yard line, cut down Indiana 45 yard line. They have four, they're creeping up with five. They rush six. He throws, got Carter. 35, 30, 25, inside the 25, and down to the 24 yard line. And a first down for the Nittany Lions. Trips near side, Scott the running back who has it. Scott to his right to the 20. Scott stiff arm to the 15, tripped up inside the 15. Hackenberg takes the snap, wants the throw. Steps up in the pocket, sees an opening to the five, dives to the end zone, touchdown Penn State. Christian Hackenberg and Jack, a 52 yard drive that we felt was the one that could knock them out and they got it. And Hackenberg who has run the football more today against a very good Indiana defense than he has all year. Play action and fumble in the football as Nassim's on top of him. Schwann goes after it, but I think it's recovered by Indiana. It is at the seven yard line. Carl Nassim on the money. They set a return, kicks it, little tumbler, and he takes it at the Indiana 47, 45, 40, 35, 30, and Tompkins inside the 30 to the 28 yard line. Waits, put down, kick by Davis is up, and the kick by Tyler Davis is good, and Penn State now leads it 29 to seven. The Nittany Lions have won five in a row. They have come back with five straight wins. We had a great atmosphere, we had a great turnout. Fans played a huge part in it. We were able to go out and get a great team win.